yeah, we are back with some more Final Fantasy 16. And yeah, I keep forgetting that when I <laughs> stop uh, playing every time, I just put my PS5 to sleep. And so we're just back right where we left off. They've only fought one version of him and left to save and stock up on food. And start doing more things yeah, a lot in this game. Is there a lot like in Breath of the Wild? I'm pretty sure. How do you like the game? It's pretty good. Um, the combat's very fluid. And it's simple yet also very um, technical at times. Especially if you want to manage cooldowns. Because in this game, you actually don't have MP. But you just have a bunch of skills. Because um, uh, I don't know if you know anything about the lore so far, but uh, your character here, Clive, is part of a... Uh, I guess bloodline that uh, gives birth to the phoenix. They call it icons instead of like idolins or summons and stuff like that. Um, and so yeah, so we have the blood of the phoenix. And so our original going to the Billy's tab. Oh, can't warp out apparently. Yeah, our original icon is the phoenix. And <laughs> so yeah, we have this little mini tech tree of just phoenix-based moves, which is fire-based, fire elemental. Uh, we just beat Benedicta, very hot female, <laughs> who had the power of the Garuda, which is wind elemental. And we uh, sucked her power dry. Uh, I guess we have a secret ability that we didn't know we had. Uh, until we use it on her. Um, so, yeah, so we took her powers, actually. So it kind of reminds me of Mega Man, actually. <laughs> Garuda. Garuda. Uh, yeah, so it's... And your Final Fantasy has always been about mythology stuff. So, you know, Phoenix, Garuda. Actually, I don't know where Garuda is from, like, myth mythology-wise. Is it from Norse mythology? Maybe from somewhere else. Um... But yeah, we uh we took her power. <laughs> it reminds me again, uh reminds me of Mega Man. We beat the boss to take their power. I have a feeling that's gonna be how it will be throughout the game. Uh there's supposed to be eight icons, icons, aeons, <laughs> what do you wanna call it? Uh because at first it was just, you know, this top Phoenix and then you know our inside ability circle. But I'm pretty sure we'll unlock the rest of them and there should be up to eight, because lore wise there's eight. Eight elementals, I assume. Eight uh, icons. Though, it's uh, interesting that one of them was uh, Ifrit, right? Fire. Another fire icon. And his legend never stated that there could be two at the same time. Or it said that there could be two at the same time. So they're always at ends with each other. Like, if it's the same element, they're always uh, well, trying to kill each other. Because there can only be one of that element. Which is interesting. Interesting lore. Um, but yeah. Uh, our bloodline, you know, tends or seems to have the ability. Maybe just Clive himself. I don't know. Because he was supposed to have uh, uh, the uh, Phoenix in him. But it didn't pass down to him. So he was like the. I don't know. Wasted child or some BS. <laughs> um, so yeah, but then his younger brother actually got the... I guess they call it the dominant trait. Well, if they get the spirit of the icon, then they are known as the dominant. They have the uh, summon within them in which they can evoke. But yeah, our guy didn't get it. Brother got it. Brother actually got brutally slain. Uh... When he was just a boy. He's just a young boy. Yeah, I don't know how much of the lore you want me to go through, but... <laughs> He's like, final game, maybe one day I would get this one. Probably about the time FF20 comes out. Yeah, FF20 will probably be in like another decade. <laughs> Pretty sure. As you know, they're remaking 7. Uh, 7 Part 2 is supposed to come out next year. I don't know how many parts there are supposed to be. Uh, I heard it's supposed to be a 3-part series. I don't know if that's supposed to emulate uh, the original having 3 discs. I don't think that's the case, but if it is, you know, very interesting coincidence. Um, yeah, uh, we'll get into the combat pretty soon here. 
So yeah, we had just beaten Benedicta and she withdrew. Oh, it's only me. Oh, it's this guy. Joey, Gaff, are you trying to get yourself killed? It's not me who's been playing with fire. Oh yeah. You don't do things by half, do you? I do enjoy that it's very medieval. Like everything's set in medieval times. Kinda like the originals. The first I'd say the first five Final Fantasies are kinda like medieval times. Six turned into a steampunk era. Seven and eight are more modern slash futuristic. Nine kinda went back to uh, medieval times. Ten was like a hybrid. Since then destroyed everything and turned everybody into tribals. Twelve was medieval again. Thirteen futuristic. Fifteen also futuristic. It was very cool. Yeah, they uh, decided to go back to kind of the roots, I suppose. Medieval times. Well, uh, I can track him. Wait, so the main quest right now is we're after the dominant that supposedly killed our brother. Through cutscene power, we come to know his name as Margrace. But yeah, we'll see. I reckon he likes you. And there's Sid. <laughs> Good old staple name in the Final Fantasy franchise. He's actually a dominant in the Thunder Element. So he holds she's Ramu. Gone. She's gone. My lady, you have to yeah. on. Here's Benedicta. Gone, 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 gone. <laughs> the hot girl. <laughs> that we just beat last time. What am I going to do? The Barnabas. <laughs> yeah, now she's useless. She doesn't have. She doesn't have her. Uh, this pace, we won't make it by sunset. Garuda powers anyone? Uh oh. He calls me up like all the others. What am I going to do? Oh, I will say this game is very. Oh, he's dead. He hella dead. I love how nobody <laughs> reacted to it right away. Carol. Man. Axe throws. This game is very brutal compared to all the other Final Fantasies. What do we have here? Foot pad. It's like the Foot Clan. Well, we'd be doing the slavers a disservice if we didn't praise our work. Uh. Stay away. Yes, we just beat her, so she's very weakened. Are we gonna help her though? Oh no. It's dead? Yep. It's alright. They can't hurt you anymore. Regrets it now. Is this it, Sadolphus? My punishment for not listening to you. Oh. Oh, what? <gasps> this wretched world. Wait, what happened? Lost it. Oh. She can transform all the way. She can transform all the way. Damn. So that's her true form, huh? So yeah, before we ha we fought like a humanoid version of her, where she just like evoked the powers but didn't like transform into the actual Garuda. Yeah. Sid. Do you feel it too? Garuda. Hmm. 
By the flames. Here we go. So I guess we really have to end her. I was hoping she had like some redemption. Arc. I don't think you understand. Right. That's not just windy weather you're wondering. <laughs> windy weather. Yeah, it's kind of hoping she had a redemption arc, but I guess it's not gonna happen. That's not a good day. I don't want to know what's waiting inside that, but I do. I have to find out, and I'm not turning back. <laughs> but yeah, if anything, this game kind of reminds me of The Witcher a lot. Same time period, you know. Kind of badass dude with the sword. He doesn't have two swords though, but one sword's fine. Also low on potions. Hopefully you pick up more potions. Here's hopefully one. It's a valley matter. I'm gonna look around, make sure I don't miss anything. I guess I do appreciate that they have the little blue sparkles, as you see. If it's an item, so it's one way over there. Can I get that? Can't get that. Inaccessible. Thank. So I want whatever that is, but I can't get to it. There's a bunch of like harpies everywhere. There are so many. So many harpies. Oh, Oh, the color. Alright, so he's. There's a fighting system. So it's a very hack and flash, but there's just so many abilities that you can cycle between. Ow. Oh, do this. I'll die. I'm not dying. Nice. I don't want to heal myself, but I really should. I'll just use a small potion. First the Greedo, <laughs> and there'd be Wolf Link. Hey, that's uh, our doggo, Torgal. We can actually pet him. Uh, not right now, though, because we're in... I guess a combative zone. Yeah. I will say that this combat system reminds me a lot of um, what's it called? Uh, Devil May Cry, actually. It's very free, free flowing. A lot of it you can actually like cancel actions into other actions. Huh? Um, well, there's items everywhere. It's not a potion. <laughs> it's, I need potions. Jump this guy. Lady. Yep. Thing. I'm dying. Sick of Toggle. Over here. Get him, boy. Get him. Get him, boy. Sick of Toggle. Oh. You know what to do, boy. Alright. 
finish her. Uh, I really wish there was a other way of healing rather than just using potions. Especially because you can only have so many potions stocked up. I can only hold, I think, four regular potions and three high potions. Five get on the floor. Dodge didn't count though. I see. Maybe I should stop fighting. <laughs> but I don't want all this experience. Dodge right way. <laughs> well, I didn't dodge at all. Switch. Ability finish. Uh, yeah, it's kind of cool they made it a little bit like a fighting game, I feel. And the way all the moves kind of chain into each other, and even like keeps tallies on like the way you fight. So like they <laughs> give you kudos for like perfect dodging or pairing, it's everything. It's good stuff. Sick of toggle. Get a boy. Oh, that was a bad idea. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, I'll just play safe. Oh. Hey, one thing I don't like is that there is actually no block button. You only dodge. Not dodge. <laughs> dodge swift. Not working. Surely. Scrape them up. Oh, nice. Yeah, so that's the actual power of this game. You just gotta keep switching between your different icons. 
it's I swapped to the Garuda for a second. And I was able to do like the it's like a frenzy slash. And it really shredded its uh it's called its will gauge. It's the yellow bar underneath their HP. Yeah, once that's broken it staggers and you kinda just unleash <laughs> your flurry on them. But yeah, I'm running out of healing. <laughs> it's really bad. Hey, you got a potion. That's yeah, going to heal, hopefully. Oh, it's a waypoint. Dragon's Airy Obelisk. He's in there. He's in there. I know it. I thought we were gonna fight her right away, but we don't have to. Uh, let's actually go back to the hideout. I need to buy more potions and stuff. Honey, I'm home. <laughs> so this is a hideout in kind of the middle of nowhere. And what do you want? This is Sharon. Go on then. Apparently she's a Karen, <laughs> which is kind of funny. I'm gonna buy this bastard sword. Mm, yeah, pretty good. Plus ten. Uh, I have plenty of gil. I buy it. You're rubbing me blind, you know. <laughs> rubbing me blind. I do like the voice acting. It's all like medieval. <laughs> Medieval dialogue. You can't find a better price than that. Steel crowns. It is better I'll be here. I'm giving them potions. There's a good chance we might find some more, so maybe I shouldn't buy too many. Let me just buy like this many. You're rubbing me blind, you know. There is a chance we might find more. Finished, are you? Oh. See if I can sell yes. anything. What? Going what? This way you down. Should I sell this? I feel like I should sell those old things. But I'll just hold on to them. If they don't like really do anything, then it's really the point of selling them. Let's see if it's this thing. Black blood. I'll be thankful you got that much. Ouch. <laughs> Oh. Okay. Let's see what the blacksmith got. Well, what's that for you, dear? Uh, we can upgrade my bastard sword that I just got. Lost you a good while. Uh, dressed to the fives. What's this? It's not as good. Uh, can't upgrade this further, so. No scratches, right? Not bad, if I do say so myself. Oh, we can reinforce them. Reinforce my best, so. Yeah, that should do ya. Wait, is this making me... Huh. So why would I want to do this? <laughs> it's like... Unrefined? Makes no sense. Mm -hmm. Oops. My best work, but it'll do. It'll do. Yeah, that should do you. Yeah. And... Uh, I think we're good. I don't think there's any side quests. Let's do this. Side quest has the green stuffs. For now, we rest. Alright, we just leave. Skip along out of here. 
always a good girl. Those chocobos. Chocobos. Alright, let's go ahead and go to the next area. Eye of the Tempest. This guy. Wait! Clive! What's that? The Dominant. The man who killed my brother. Are you absolutely certain? I've seen him every night for the past 13 years. Watch Interesting. The flames of his eye contact, Joshua. Interesting guy. Oh, damn. <laughs> he just kicks us out of the way. <laughs> Not this guy. <laughs> Yeah, but it's like, I don't remember seeing, uh, Margus, 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 that dominant guy. Maybe I just gotta rewatch the cutscene or something, but I don't remember seeing that guy. Maybe I was distracted or something. That guy. Awakening. I do like how they kind of preface every mission with... Oh, spooky. Where did he go? They, pre they preface every mission with... You know, a title and all that. Ah, oh! That's you! Benedicta. Surprise, she didn't do much. Go Ruda! What? Of course, it's gonna be a wild goose chase the whole time. You probably won't even get to catch capture. Man, this is the power of wind right here. She's toying with me. Yeah, we're pretty much in her mercy right now because <laughs> we're in her element. All the wind everywhere. Ah. <laughs> we could easily be slain, like, at any moment. Uh, this way, actually. Yeah, this game is definitely a lot more... ...greedy and realistic out of all the Final Fantasies. Kinda gives me like Game of Thrones vibes too. You called me. Why? Uh, though I never actually played, or not played, watched Game of Thrones. But gives me those vibes. So are we fighting her up on this hill? <laughs> I don't think we can actually beat her as is. We have to like transform as well. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's why it's called awakening. A what? Ah. Uh. <laughs> it does like no damage. Stab her face. That's our butt. The butt cheeks. Oh. Uh, take down. Large enemies will become partially staggered when their will gauges are reduced to 50%. Using Garuda's deadly embrace on a partially staggered enemy will topple it. 
leaving it invulnerable to a follow up attacks. Get down here. Rip it up, rip it up. Oh dang, it's tripping in the air. Oh, was the wrong button. Oh dang. Yes. Uh, so I should have bought more potions. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Slash, slash, slash. <laughs> oh, almost 10k damage. That's whack. Oh, she didn't like that though. Uh oh. What you doing? Using arrow. Aerial blast. Can't do anything about this. Shooting at you. Oh, whoa. I cannot get close to her like that. Oh, dodged. Oh, I got slapped. Can't see. <laughs> Get down here. She had a little wind thingy on there. I dodged so early on that. Alright, it's over. Oh, I, I was too far away for that. I didn't do nearly as much damage. Fin Ooh! Run your eyeballs. Eye nose. <laughs> Finish her! Strong five. Ah! Got her toenail off. And her other <laughs> part of her toe. Or was that her wing? I don't even know. That was her wing. Uh, it's over. <laughs> right in the eyeball. Rudest thing. Oh, we level up. Nice. We only gained two strength this time. Sharp fang, nice. Uh, sorry, Benedicta. You could have redeemed yourself, but you went berserk. Now you're dead. That's crazy, though. Uh, so we're just a regular dude. We beat a icon. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I take it back. She can regen. She's cheating. You're nothing. A monster. 
Hey, Sid, come help us. Oh, are we gonna transform? Oh. Yeah, we're transforming. We are Ifrit. We are Ifrit. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, we didn't transform all the way then. Are we? Did we? Oh, we got it. I knew it. Dang. Wonder how he's gonna feel about this. So yeah, for the past 13 years, Climb has been searching for whoever dominant has Efree like this. And he's gonna find out it's gonna be himself. <laughs> oh man. Anyways. Embodying Efreet. Controls for Efreet are as follows. Melee attack and range attack. And then it's still evade. Uh, Iconic lunge. Uh, so can be used to charge an enemy. Uh, covering great distances in a short period of time. As well as dealing damage if the enemy is struck. All abilities available while embodying Ifrit can be confirmed. In the abilities tab in the main menu. Oh. Coming for you. Oh, damn. <laughs> Drag her on the ground. Punish. There's some fireballs. Oh no. Not today though. So crazy. So much damage, too. Skyfall. We tried this earlier. Oh, give me that shit. <laughs> but you take it back. Take it back. Dodge out of there and just fireballs into it. Oh, it clashed. Fireball wars, eh? My fireballs are faster. I guess I charge mine faster. It's like Pokemon battles now. <laughs> like this all day. So I do want to close the distance though, so you do more damage faster. Ah, uh, dang it. Too impatient. Oh, what? Nah, where are you taking me? Ow. <laughs> 
It's like Dragon Ball Z now. Shoot all these chi balls at us. Give me that. Oh, what? <laughs> God damn. My arm. I need my arm back. Ooh. Crazy. Hellfire! Slam. Oh, his leg broke up. <laughs> Her leg broke up. Finish! Oh, ground and pound. <laughs> this is how we killed our brother. Oh, secret leg pops out. What do you think, going girl? Ah, I guess. Uh oh, chill, girl. Chill, girl. <laughs> She's not gonna go down without a fight. Too late. Oh, Jesus. Hellfire. Get burned alive. Damn, it's over. <laughs> Jesus. So brutal. Brutal slain again. Hey, level up. Oh, <laughs> yeah. It's wild. They really outdid themselves with all this. All the cinematics and everything. Dang. <laughs> Blown to smithereens. Yeah, she's hella dead. He's not done yet. Stop this now. It was a judgment bolt. It was judgment bolt. It was really cool. Oh, it was Ramu. He transformed. He hit us with that judgment bolt to stop us. So our Benedict is technically still alive. Oh. It's, it looks like Zeus. It's Ramu. It's funny because like Euphrit or you know Clive reminds me of uh, a Titan, like Eren from Attack on Titan. Just goes berserk. <laughs> it doesn't care what's in front of him. It's killing everybody. Oh, Judgment Bolt time. Judgment Bolt. <laughs> like, chill out. Eh. It's crazy. 
<laughs> yeah, <laughs> so that definitely takes a toll. You're too nice is your problem. <laughs> You're too nice. Bloody mess this. Probably the whole force is pretty much gone. Real question is where's Benedicta? She's still alive. Or she did. Yeah, Clive's gonna find out that he's the one who killed his brother. I wonder how that's gonna work out. He's probably gonna hate himself. Oh, now Sid finds out the truth too. It's like, so you killed your own brother. You been chasing? Yeah. It was inside you all along. <laughs> I'll be damned if I know what that means. I wonder if that means he's resented his younger brother. Like, secretly. That's Benedicta. She's done. She's done. Oh. <laughs> Final words for Benedicta. Yeah, they used to be lovers, I think, because he, like, saved her. It was, like, a little flashback. But we saw that he saved her first from some... Men. Why? Why did you have to listen to him? Banner. No. This can't be what you wanted, can it? So sad. Some time later. They're fighting again. He rides! He rides. Odin! Oh. So that's uh, Barnabas. Oh, Jesus. Will you engage him personally, Your Highness? Of course. He's a big boy, yeah. Oh, what's up, Lindsay? How's it going? Who's he gonna turn into is my question. Bahamut? Is that Bahamut? Yeah. Bahamut versus Odin, huh? Bahamut technically has the advantage, but we'll see what Odin does. Is that Tetsuka? <laughs> just cuts everything. It's hella big boy. It's Bahamut! It's Bahamut. <laughs> Mega player. Oh, that's just a regular player. Oh, it's intense. Uh oh. <laughs> Oops. Waiting for it to happen. It's whack that they, uh, which have icon wars. Whoever has the best icons will win. What's he gonna do? He's gonna try to destroy this village. Those two really need to not fight on top of their armies. Yeah, exactly. What the heck? That's it. <laughs> like, I'm done here. Just. That's all I had time for. <laughs> I need some juice to replenish his powers. Reform the cohorts. At once. 
It was like that in the, the previous fight. It was Shiva against Titan. They fought over their armies. <laughs> I was like, what the? They didn't care who died. Say, so is there even a point to having armies? <laughs> Summon your beasts. Saboteurs. Saboteurs. Their attacks are frequent and widespread. Even in the holy capital. The capital. What if my father is here? Radiance is safe. Radiance. But he has ordered the city guard strengthened. We can expect no reinforcements. That is of no matter. The Emperor's safety is paramount. I shall deal with our enemies here. <laughs> it's taking like a lunch break. Now back on the field. Oh, Clive, you're naked. It's Clive. I'm pretty sure it's Clive. But why are you naked? <laughs> why did he take his clothes? It was me. Oh no, he's coming to terms on what he did. I killed Joshua. Why wouldn't he be naked? I don't know. <laughs> it didn't seem like the time or place to be naked. <laughs> and chained up. <laughs> Naked and chained up. Ah, you're awake. You're just full of surprises. First that trick with Garuda thing. Whatever the hell that other thing was. Didn't know you had it in you. <laughs> Do it. Do it. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> was me. I killed him. I killed Joshua. I killed them all. I'm a monster, and I deserve to die. So end it. End it. Please, please. Ah! <laughs> they get a grip on you. <laughs> get a grip. I love how the punch had no sound to it. That's what you want. But first, I thought I'd give you the benefit of my timeless wisdom. It seems to me, you see, that since you're still breathing, you might as well make yourself useful. Get dressed. Pretty as you are, you're not <laughs> my type. Ass. I'll, uh... See you in all. Cheeks, though. <laughs> I know it's supposed to be a very emotional moment, but. <laughs> Can't be naked like a. Uh... <laughs> Ruined it. Good question. The wages of guilt. Uh, quest lock. There are certain times during the game that side quests will become temporarily unavailable until progress has been made through the main scenario. At such times, quest givers uh, will be indicated with a padlock on their quest bubble. There's what he has to say. Don't go making me throw you back in there now, eh? Oh, what? Were you the one who made me nick? <laughs> well, well, so would it be? Oh, well, I can buy a new weapon. I don't even need the best episode. What? Is it? I feel like I wasted that. I didn't know. It actually kind of made the fight a lot easier then. No scratches, right? It's had more damage. Nice. Can't reinforce it. Oh, I can't reinforce it. For better or worse. I 
kind of wish I had like an elemental uh, thing to it. Yeah. It looks cool though. And what do you want? What do you want? Go on then. So I should not have bought the Master Sword. That's okay. I didn't know. Uh, battle chains. I'm assuming I can craft these actually, or like increase. Oh, reduces Rook's gambit cooldown by 2.7 seconds for 11k. <laughs> I can sell something to get 11k, but I don't think that's worth. Come again. Oh, don't. Or don't. I'm not much bothered either way. <laughs> Just fine. All right, Sid, what you got? Finally crawled out of the crypt, eh? You look like it. Although I thank you for doing us the courtesy of covering up. <laughs> Don't. Well, still have a bit of fight left in you. Then listen. I've arranged a meeting with Gav. In case you've forgotten, you're the one who's been putting his nose to work for. For nothing. Who was the other guy then? Just listen. While you've been relaxing in yourself, there's definitely a, another robed dude knowledge. with some lady that got stabbed earlier. Reports, he's picked up a scent. Gav's gone through a fair bit of trouble for you. The least you can do is hear the poor bugger out. He's going to meet us at the King's Fall. Pack your stuff. We'll leave as soon as you're ready. Hey. What does any side quest before I go? Odin and Bahama had at it by all accounts. Odin Bahama. Is that book interesting? Are there no side quests? Uh... Oh, <laughs> so they're just lying about the side quests. <laughs> Let's just go then, I think. Here my activities. Let's go. King's Fall. Not so long ago, this here was a thriving trade route. Then the blight came. The people left. And just like that, it was deserted. Make it see. the perfect little shortcut. Gab's waiting for us over there. Come on. That's a really nice sword. Still feeling sorry for yourself? Please, think about it, Clive. The rumors all point to... That was an Imperial signal. They shouldn't be here. The old fort's been abandoned for years. Our little chat can wait. I need to see what the bastards are up to. You go on ahead and meet up with Gav. But we both know that... No buts about it. <laughs> no buts. CRC Nars. Doggo. Oh, hey, Rex, isn't there a dog in um, Tears of the Kingdom or something? Maybe I'm remembering that incorrectly. The hunter and the hunt. Yeah, we can actually pet our doggo. You like that, don't you? You like that? Have you seen a few? Oh, but you can't actually like have them be your travel companion. No? Oh, so sad. This is stupid. This is stupid. Of fire. We sent Galvin on a wild goose chase. Poor chunks. Wait, you're going the right way?
What do you mean? Just jump down? Oh, I guess so. Oh, my knees. Oh, the spiders. Black Widow. I love how the spiders have money on them. <laughs> Sounds like a bear. Oh, it's a big boy. Troll man. Oh wait, it's a Minotaur. There's no Minotaurs in Far Fancy. Oh maybe they are, I don't remember. <laughs> Beast back. Ah uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Whoops. There's now, you're right. Get out of that corner. <laughs> How about that? Yeah, at least this guy. <laughs> at least this is the Minotaur. Maybe there were Minotaurs, I just don't remember. Almost 10k damage. But that was a whiz. Whoa. Kinda glad my dog doesn't really take damage. I dodge way too early. Yeah. I only gives eighteen experience, despite it being a big, big battle. I kind of wish we could craft potions. That would be nice. Wait, why am I? Why am I talking about? There are minotaurs. It's like legitimately a summon that's called minotaur. <laughs> Final Fantasy VIII. I'm not sure about previous Final Fantasies, like before eight. But yeah, there is minotaur in Final Fantasy VIII. I feel like I should uh, buy one of these super moves. It's a lot of ability points I need.
So yeah, let me just stock up points to try to get this. Though I could... Nah. Because you can actually reset all your abilities and then funnel the points where you want them, but... Nah, I'll just... Hold off. Save the points. Two pinches of magic ash. Can't be much further now. More spiders. everywhere. I can't go up there. to ask the dog. Dog? Oh, I saw it. I saw it the last second. Oh, it's another big boy. Oh, it's spiders. Dodge didn't count. <laughs> I love how he, he like dashes, but he can't fall off the side. Keep your distance, boy. Could react to that. Wow, I try to jump over him. Get 
Yeah. Oof. Oh, he fell off the cliff. Oh, I thought he fell. <laughs> I thought he backflipped off the cliff. There. More potions. Ooh, a high potion. Sir. This one's a dessert. Take his head out of my way. You made your choice. Sick of Toggle. Don't let them get away. Finish him. Look at him. Is it? Oh, it's, it's a dragoon. Dragoon. And this thing. Damn. Hey, maybe fight both at the same time. A dragoon and his wife. Jesus. There's too many. We gotta go. We have to fight all these guys. Oh no, we got Ramu. Hell yeah. Oh, they did. <laughs> I love how they kind of censored it <laughs> with all the rocks. Clive, what's the situation? You're late. Captain Trouble. What? The Imperials are on his tail. We have to get to him before they do. Understood. I'm here to even the odds. Any objections? Yay. I'll uh, take the dragon. You take the dragoon. Too slow. Too slow. Oh. You know, die, you bastard. Wow. Sorry, lad. Don't know how much help I'm going to be here. Oh, I didn't even dodge. Oh, he killed the dragon. You know what to do, boy. Ow. Double jump. I dodged really. I did dodge out. Oh. 
Nice. Nice. You know what to do, boy. Sick of talking. Get up. Keep your distance, boy. There, boy. You like that? Sick of talking. Oh. <laughs> Got him. Bloody time waster. Come on, let's finish him up. You know what to do, boy. Get him. Yeah. <laughs> Night of the Dying Sun slain. All their lunch money. Sweet. Here, Link. Got him. These dragoons are something else. Come on. Uh, his arm. Shit. Oh, Gab's gonna die. Oh, that Titan. <laughs> Titan from uh, Destiny 2. That's something like that. Give me your hand! Yeah, it's been cut. So bad. His arm been cut. Uh, can really imagine how much pain he's in. Oh. Like this new main character, Clive? Yeah. It's definitely more mature. Uh, I feel like a lot of the other Final Fantasy characters have to like go to that character development. Though, Five does have to, because again he has to deal with knowing he killed his own brother, but for the most part though he's pretty uh... <laughs> pretty mature. I have your nose, I said. He'd stumble off a cliff, I said. Well, that's a trouble with a nose like mine. Can't help sticking it where it's not wanted. But if it wasn't for you two, my sniffing days would be over. Sniffing days. Thank you. Truly. So, what news? Well, I uh, found out where your friend's heading for one thing. Gav, I... Him and his mate are on their way to your old stomping ground. Rosaria. Rosaria. You should have seen what they did to the Imperials who tried to stop them. There's no question about it. He's a dominant fire, all right. He can't be. Clive, I saw you turn into an icon before my very eyes. And yes, there's a good chance it was you who killed the Phoenix. But we weren't alone, were we? It was the fellow you saw enter the whirlwind. I... I saw him too. But I'm not you crazy. dream it, Clive. <laughs> He's out there. <laughs> Who is he? He's your brother. Don't ask me. I don't bloody know. That would be another twist too. His brother's actually alive. You're gonna find him and find out. Even though 
After all, I don't know. You swore <laughs> I don't want to conjecture too much. You swore you'd avenge your brother's death, that you'd never rest until you'd hunted down the man responsible. So, find out if this man's responsible. And kill yourself. And kill yourself if he's not. There. Easy. Sit. I don't thank me. Thank God. <laughs> Thank you, Gav. Yeah, I am. <laughs> yeah, he's definitely a lot more mature than most of the Final Fantasy protagonists, I would say. No birds returning this year. No, the chocobos. The dead ones have swallowed their roosts, like as not. That is Joshua. I know it. <laughs> I know it. We'll the reason why we yet see okay. his face. Back to where it all began. I knew it. <laughs> it's Joshua. He must be stopped. Mm, must be wild, though. All right, back to the hideout. I do kind of feel like they re revealed it too early, but I don't know. we'll see. You think I'm having you alive? Your friend, she's awake. Chill. Right. Go to her, you fool. <laughs> Chill. Right, you lot. Enough slacking. Goots, come with me. Goots. Gav, go and get those wounds seen to. Oh, oh, give it to me straight. Oh, my God. <laughs> this guy. So? All in good time. Let's make ourselves scarce. <laughs> Jill. Jill. Oh, it's a Moogle. It's a Moogle. It's a Moogle. Hippo. I'm sure it's said in my father's bestiary that they live deep in the forest. And that they never reveal themselves to humans. <laughs> Nectar, you say? Nectar. Clive. <laughs> you understand Moogle tongue, Kubo? <laughs> Why is there a voice actor for the Muko? So it would seem. Finally, Koopo. Where's Mog at? I've been trying to talk to these people ever since the winds carried me here, but none of them understand a word I say. I that sounds didn't get to read the rest of it. <laughs> and now here you are, my pom pom safe at last. You can hear me. You can actually hear me, Koopo. Mm. There really are no side quests right now. That's its fault. You tied it too tight. Mm. Can it be something? And his dishes taste good. Oh, it's Tarja. And Gav. So there's no side quest, I guess. That guy doesn't have a shirt on. <laughs> Must be that What's hot in this cave. You? What'd you want? What'd you want? What do you buy? There's no upgrades for that sort of. Anything else? I should really buy like more potions. And what do you want? Going purse weighing you down. Oops. 
Let's make sure I have. You can't find a better price than that. Finished, are you? Some. Visit the infirmary. Talk to Jill. Let's get this fixed before someone. Jill. <laughs> she has Tifa's hair. It's true then. It really is you. It is. Clive. I was like, yeah, are you guys gonna brace or what? You're alive. So are you. It's awkward because we actually like fought each other <laughs> earlier and we like knocked her out. So, oops. I didn't know <laughs> you were trying to kill me. Yes. Taya told me what happened. Taya. You saved my life. So, geez, I, why? Taking it. I had no idea. Forgive me, but how did you ever come to be there, Jill? Fighting for them. The Iron Blood. They invaded not long after the news arrived. Mm -hmm. About Fink's Gate. Rosaria had lost her leaders. The Duchy was in chaos. The Iron Kingdom saw our weakness and pounced upon it. They killed the men. <laughs> captured the women. Took you back to Ino. Vikings. I thought they meant to have their fun with me before the end. But the end never came. <laughs> My powers awoke and everything mm. changed. It all happened so fast. We were told that the Iron Blood had captured a dominant and planned to bring her on their latest crusade. Hmm. They gave me a choice. To fight for them on the battlefield or... See my countrywomen slaughtered. Oh. And they call us dominance. You too. What? Surprise! What happened to Clive? What happened at Phoenix Gate? It was me. I killed Joshua. No, that's not true. I know you, you wouldn't do that. It's the truth. I changed into him again, not long ago. The second icon of fire, the one responsible. <laughs> Clive. When I think back to that night. The hoodie man. He Oh, what? We have found you. What did he mean? Clive, we should go back there, to Phoenix Gate. I need to know what really happened, and so do you. You need to know for certain. And if what you told me is true, and you did what you said you did, then we will face it together. Oh. Jill, I... All right. You'll be needing a change of clothes then. <laughs> Surprise! Don't you go, your lordship. We wouldn't want you getting overexcited. 
Oh, what? Uh, sorry. <laughs> I'll see you soon then, Clive. Oh, she's so cute. I should make ready too. Oh, side quests. There's a long journey ahead of us. Let's do some side quests. We're looking at half a dozen. It's a mobile. We just don't have enough teams to follow. No. Ah, Clive. I trust you're settling in? Gradually getting used to the place. I'm glad to hear it. I was hoping you might be persuaded to come to my aid once more. Your services will be rewarded, of course. I don't doubt it. Seems to be the way around here. We strive to be better than those we once served. Now, as to the task itself, I am once again in need of a pair of hands to deliver sustenance to our esteemed companions. I have three meals for three industrious souls. What say you? What say you? Easy. I'd be happy to help. Marvelous. The three individuals you'll be seeking out are busying themselves about the hideaway. You'll find one by the entrance, another in the bunks, and the other guarding the cells. Thank you once again, Clive. I am glad they kind of tell us where they are. So I don't have to go guessing. There you go, lady. Chocobo keeper. Ooh, something smells good. For me, I hope. It is. Courtesy of Kenneth. Kenneth. Here you go. Oh, my thanks. These birds are needy creatures. They don't like me running after the fat chocobo. Fat chocobo. <laughs> <laughs> they must keep you busy. Ah, there's never a moment's rest. Probably for the best Aww, I eat down here. Sleeping. Reeking at the stables as I do. I don't even put people off their food. And who has time to wash and dress for dinner? I forget, I forget somebody asked me if I, I could get anything from a Final hey, Fantasy game. For the food and be I sure told them I would like a chocobo. I guess the second would be like a Moogle. Chocobo or a Moogle. This one's sleeping. Oh, it's not sleeping. <laughs> so I said, you're sleeping with your while standing up. Yeah. That would be cool. To have a Chocobo as a pet or a Moogle as a companion. I'd take a Tifa. <laughs> well, I mean, obviously. But can't really get those. <laughs> Back so soon. Fancied another kip in the cells, did you? Kenneth sent me. He thought you might be hungry. Yes, I would oh, like a Tifa as well. Or Nares. Or one of the other my fancy waifus. He wasn't wrong. The way my gut's been growling, I'd have curls running scared. <laughs> God, duty down here can't be much fun. It's not. But sometimes folk need locking up, and someone has to watch over them. I help people sleep at night, and that's not a boast many can make. You keep yourself on the right side of these bars now, you hear me? I would give for some wild Mickey berries. Can I help you? Can I send me? Eat this. Ah, wonderful. Do you hear that? Our food has arrived. Does your appetite still elude you? Is he sick? <sighs> I'm afraid so. Those no longer in need of a physica's immediate administrations are sent here for further rest. I tend to those who cannot tend to themselves, mm -hmm. which leaves me very little time for anything else. Happily, Kenneth sees that I stay fed. I would be lost without the kindness of good people like him and yourself. Thank you. Thank I think you. that's everyone. But let Kenneth know. 
Uh, let's go and pick up the side quest while I'm back here. You, newcomer, I need help. What's the matter? It's my assistant. She left to gather soil, and I've seen nothing of her since. Uh -oh. I cannot concentrate one whit for fear of what might have happened. Please, I beg of you, will you go and check? I have to know. All right, I'll go. Marvelous. Thank you. You'll be rewarded for your time, of course. Whereabouts is she? Gotan Spales. It's on the outskirts of Lost Week. Mm. Not the safest place for an unaccompanied bearer, perhaps. But the soil there is second to none. Now go, and do not linger. Why, it may already be too late. Moving heaven and earth. Let's find this assistant. Is it the Moogle fun? We'll make fun of the Moogle. Ah, you're back. All done? Wonderful. Here, your reward, as promised. Thank you. The hideaway is quite something. Everyone has their place. A fact we are proud of, believe me. I'm glad you've witnessed it for yourself. You have your place too, of course, as you have just so capably proven. And you will always have a place with us, should you desire it. It's kind of you to say so. It is the truth, and not a soul among us would deny it. I look forward to all that you will bring to our little community. Nice. Ooh. 100 ability points. Deal bug. Oh, he, he gave me this last time too. I'm like, why didn't you just give me actual money? Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and talk to Sharon while I'm here. Then I'll try to find the assistant. What do you want? To say farewell. We're leaving. Yeah. Good decision. Better that than buried out there in the black. You've got a lot to thank that girl for, you know. I know. And I will. Now, what do you really want? We both know you don't come here for conversation. <laughs> oh, Gaia Blade. It's so crazy, like, how fast you get new stuff, like... <laughs> so, do I even want to buy this? Because <laughs> it makes the other weapons obsolete so quickly. I can buy this. Don't really want to though. Off you go then. I should probably say. Oh, Torgo. Torgo. Make it quick. So will it be? Um, see some. Find me later. My best work, but it'll do. Mm, wait, can I just have crafted the weapon instead of buying it? Oh well, whatever. <laughs> Ooh, this is better. worth plus two defense. So yeah, I made the storm cry obsolete already. <laughs> so it's like I barely had this. And then 
me see. Like it would make more sense if it had like some element attached to it, but it doesn't. It's kind of just for show. Talk to you too. So your mind's made up, is it? We'll be leaving for Rosaria as soon as we're able. Back down memory lane, eh? Rosaria ain't what she used to be, Clive. Not since the Imperials moved in. First sign of trouble, you make straight for Martha's rest and ask for the landlady. She's a friend of the cause. Tell her you with Sid, and she'll help you out. Understood. Thank you, Gav. Yeah. <laughs> I'd be lost without you. Yeah, I'm just doing my job. Gav. You need to make such a fuss. <laughs> Gav gets embarrassed and flustered pretty easily. <laughs> you take care. Oh, I see that he's already healed up. His bandage is no longer on his arm. Oh, crap, Ed, goodbyes. Where's Sid when you need him? <laughs> Give him my regards when he gets back. I will. Alright, Jill, let's go. Oh, yeah. Nice. Sorry to keep you waiting. That's a nice outfit. Ready, my lady. Ready. Alright, let's do the side quest first, then we'll do the Rosaria one. Alright. <laughs> Joe's like, you sure you went the right way? <laughs> it's like we're nowhere near where we're supposed to be. Did Jill follow us, or is it just Torgo? Oh, she did! Nice. She's like, we are not where we're supposed to be. I what? It's very <laughs> poignant stream. I love how we can just run through all these vines like nothing. Oh, spiders! Enemies approach. Get him, boy. Get him. Over here. There, boy. Sick of Togo. Over here. You know what to do, boy. Get him, boy. Yay. Are you hurt? It would have been worse if you hadn't come along. Where? Well, I've seen you around the hideaway. You're new, aren't you? I'm Clive. And I'm Martel. But what are you doing here? Looking for you. This is no place for a bearer on her own. I noticed that. <laughs> but this soil's not going to collect itself. True. Then what if I gathered it for you? You could head back to the hideaway. And get that dirt for you. What sort of dirt is it that you need? What I need is soil. But I'd be a fool <laughs> to refuse your help after what just happened. It's the good stuff you're looking for. The good stuff. Dark, rich, fragrant. You'll know it when you find it. Dark, rich, and fragrant. Right. Well, you should hurry back. 
Bohemil seemed worried enough that he might come looking for you himself. That seems unlikely, but I won't argue with you. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Oh yeah, I'm gonna find that dark dude. Sorry, There's certainly enough of it here. But is it dark, rich, and fragrant? I love how it does it for you. Too far. This is the same exact patches I just grabbed from. <laughs> that should be enough. I better get it back to the It's fine because we could easily let her gather and we just guard her. But just being awkward. <laughs> That was very quick. That'd be cool if we get some like um, Easter egg great swords. I like, imagine if they crafted a master sword, not a master sword. <laughs> a master sword would be cool, but. A buster sword? Yes, she's standing right there. Not the girl. The soil. <laughs> Did you bring it? You didn't give a shit about the girl. Uh, yes. I yeah. need my soil. Glorious. <laughs> Glorious. When Martel came home empty handed, I almost had a fit. But with this, <laughs> with this, my research can continue. First and foremost come the measurements. I must know how much ether each sample contains. From there... Wait, so you were never... Worried about me? Sorry to disappoint you, but the only thing he worries about is his research. But that's... That's all right. It's just how he is. And if it wasn't for him, we wouldn't be growing anything in these ruins. It's a small price to pay. <laughs> Although, you shouldn't have to pay it too. Did he even offer you anything for helping? Ugh. Here. <laughs> this guy. I know it's not much, but it's something. List. Your lunch money? Is it lunch money? <laughs> oh. I wish I could have eaten some fruit too, but you're not likely to thank me if I do. Still, we'll grow something worth eating one of these days, and when we do, you'll have first pick. Oh wow, that's a lot of stuff actually. Thank you. Mm, chicken's in the way. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Slady. Coin purse weighing you down. Alright, sell this. Bug. What is it? Gill bug. You got out else? Finished, are you? Go ahead and start this next part. Yeah, I'm pretty glad like the side quests aren't a too long or too like abundant. So I know Final Fantasy 15 they just littered us with all this side quest stuff. It's Joe. They definitely gave Joe the Tifa haircut. That? It's been 13 years. This place, I think Tifa's hair is longer, the but smell of the still. Grass. It's just as I remember it. You haven't been back either. I couldn't. Rand did keep a close watch on each other in the Imperial Army. You get beheaded just for knowing a deserter. The only way out was on a mission. I see. I 
Obviously, I was afraid. Afraid to go back. Here now. Thanks to you. Imperial Province of Rosaria. We should press on. Homecoming. That's in the top of the hill must be Martha's rest. Gav said the landlady's a friend. But can we say the same for her patrons? Imperials don't tend to take well to those with my mark. If anyone asks, I'm a branded soldier, sworn to protect my noble mistress. <laughs> noble mistress. Look at the fusion. Oh, we have to fight this bull. Oh, is that Bihorn? Ball. Oh, he's going crazy. She fire at him. Oh, he jumped in. Drop that blizzard on him. Nice. Nice. Got some black blood. <laughs> I love how we just come into the countryside and just kill their bull. Oh! Crabs! Crawfish! <laughs> Frying some crawfish. Pretty funny. Oh, what did we just get? I don't even know. It's been fun, but I'm going to watch a thing with someone. Have a good night and be easy. Sounds good. Appreciate you stopping, Ben. Hope you enjoyed watching me wreck things and. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. So have a good night. Hope your watch party is fun. I'll catch you later. Oh, <laughs> just kick the crawfish. Uh, kick the crawfish. That's a lot of mutant-sized crawfish. <laughs> like, what the heck?
Three briar clamshells. Was that a vampire something? -some? Death Blossom, level up. I see his high quest. I never finished building the bridge then. After what happened at Phoenix Gate, it didn't seem the highest priority. Uh, let's go this way. Actually, let's talk to the guy first, see what the side quest is. Oi! Here! You couldn't give me an iron, could you? Typical. A bloody bearer. Just when I thought my luck had changed. So, better a crumb of crystal than an empty hand, I suppose. Though it pains me to use another man's branded. Here, you understand me, don't you? I need your help. These blasted birds must have caught away from my cargo, and now they've got me surrounded. And it was really late as it was. <laughs> I've got something special needs delivering before the rest, but I dare not leave my cart untended. You couldn't run it up to Martha's rest for me, could you? Needs to get there quick, mind. Might as well. Fine. That's the spirit. All right, here. You hand that to the stable master and no one else. I'm owed a little something for it. If he gives it to you, pass it along to your master by way of thanks. Be off with you then, and don't go taking any detours on the way. Yeah, this world sucks. What a bird wants. If I do that, I'm gonna go this way. Enemy. Sharp pains. We got some big boys and little boys. Dodge in time. Item back here. I guess I grabbed it. That was nearby. Oh, a chest. Ten sharpings. Mm, 
All right. Hornets. Oh yeah. Level up off these hornets. Oh wow, everything's at 50. There's another big boy over there. Kill this big boy. He jumped at me. I wasn't ready for that, actually. Chest. Yeah, chests are very hidden, but I feel like a lot of the stuff I don't necessarily need. They're just crafting materials that yeah, I kind of have a lot of, actually. Uh, Alright, I think we can go to the side quest. Like an imperial. That's 
Do I take him in? Are you the stable master? I was asked to deliver this to you. This is for me, right enough. Not sure what some bearer is doing bringing it to me, though. Where's that fool of a peddler got to? He couldn't come himself. His cart's surrounded by wild chocobos. Huh. Sounds about right. <laughs> Have it full of Gizal Greens, no doubt. Gizal Greens. Green, if I know him. Gizal Greens. Chocobos go mad for them, don't they? Oh, we get to ride chocobos now. Probably. If you forget to seal the car up tight, the smell gets out. And <laughs> birds come running from miles around. Mm, chocobos. Don't get me wrong. They're a fine investment for a savvy merchant. Especially around these parts. But you can't get greedy, as our mutual friend is learning the hard way. Still, I got my wares, and that's all that matters. Be sure to pass your master my regards. Hmm. Right, I guess we don't get to ride chuckles yet. Enemy down there. Kill a bee. I wonder if Martha is as friendly as Gav claims. Let's go and find out, shall we? Very good, sweet spoon. What's a teleport point? These goss all greens. Chest. Forever more story is on roll. What? The bridge will be fixed when it's fixed. <laughs> Definitely not going that way. If it weren't for that mark, I'd be on you like a rash. <laughs> Damn, girl. Golf coin. You ain't pulled that sword from its scabbard in days. Come on. <laughs> Bruh. Have an hour, Luke. Don't be shy. Fresh cuts. Fresh cuts. Get your fresh cuts. Get your fresh cuts. Oh, this goes downstairs. Bye, Jill. Oh. This <laughs> Joe got it. Is this like the back side? It is the back side. Mm, I guess I can go a lap around for fun. What's a crab? Crabby. Make a little crab. I'm almost having up for the uh, new Phoenix skill. What's a Turtoise? Not sure if it's an Adamant Toys. It is an Adamant Toys. Oh, it's hit me with his head. <laughs> Headbutt. Get him, boy. Get him. Knock 
my girlfriend. I dodge that. I dodged too early again. Black of blood. Anything else over here? Chest back here. Press the wrong button. Wrong button. <laughs> no, Joe. I think I got everything in this area.
Mm. Yeah, I really don't know if there's like random chests or chests in the bushes. Oh, that's a rainbow chocobo. Stop on the bee. Hey, do we have to fight these chocobo? I know. Oh, we have to. We don't have to, but we're doing it. Sorry, chocobo. Chocobo meat. We call it bluebird and not chocobo. Sorry, <laughs> bluebird. Some black blood from it. Just killing everything. Nothing here. Hmm, chest. Ten pinches of magic ash. Yeah, I will say the level design's crazy. It's so detailed. Oh, these guys just spawned in.
<laughs> get everything. Another Coco Bow. A bluebird. Enough now. Just get it. Summon a massive pillar of fire that burns all enemies. So this is better than the spin. Might be. Well, you can upgrade it <laughs> for so many points. Oh yeah, there you go. Get it. Flames of rebirth. Yep, we're doing it. Uh, item. She's a flames of rebirth on this guy. Get him, boy. See, the only bad thing about the new move is it has a hell of a long cooldown, cooldown, which makes sense. It's a lot of damage and heals us. So. 
Oh, is this the bridge they were talking about? Nope. Can I just teleport? Oh, I can. Are we down out here? Still some left. I think that's it out here, so let's teleport back. And finally talk to Martha. Martha Stewart. Hello. It was good, honest work building the hardwood. Excuse me, would you happen to be the landlady? Depends who's asking, <laughs> and why they have an imperial bearer with them. For protection, which hopefully won't be needed, if you can advise me on the safest route to the west. It's your friend here I'd be worried about. Uh. Bears don't have an easy time of it in Rose area. Even a strat and lad like him might attract the wrong kind of attention. And if he gets nabbed, it ain't likely to end up for you either. Then we'll just have to stay out of the malicious way. Nabbed. Gav said you might be able to help us. Follow me. Sorry for before. Can't be too wary of strangers asking questions in our game. I'm Martha, an old Martha. friend of Sid's. Martha. He said he had high hopes for a bearer who joined recently. I expect that's you. So, so sad. where is it you're headed? For Phoenix Gate. We have questions that need answering. Is that so? Oh. Well, if you want to avoid the garrison, the road through East pulls your best bet. Or it would be, if the bridge hadn't collapsed. Avoid blooming nuisance it is. We've had no trade with the village for weeks. I did ask our carpenter to take a look at it. But he went out on another job. And he hasn't come back. Mm. Do you think something might have happened to him? Fingers crossed he's just taking his time. The alternative didn't bear thinking about. We'll find him. And make sure he's safe. Bring him home. We both need that bridge repaired. Your carpenter sounds like the man to do it. I see why Sid's got such a soft spot for you. If you could, I'd be in your debt. You said that he went out on a job? Right. He went down into the marshes to check on another bridge. The one by the Fallen Gate. The marshes were dangerous at the best of times. We should hurry. There's a ladder to the side of the gate. That's the quickest ladder. way down to give a head for ladder. heights. His name is Bernard. Should you find him, Bernard. Bad, tell him Martha sent you. And he's wanted at the bridge to Eastpool. Let's do it. To the marshes then. Let's find that ladder. There's nothing over here. Torgo. It's probably there some. Here's the gate. And that must be the ladder. Ladder. I don't care what your orders are, Brandon. Ah, get away from me! 
What was that? It came from under the bridge. It's crawfish. Come on. Great craw. Great claw. Whoops. Hold on, we're coming. That's enough. Oh, yeah. You, Bernard. Thank you, my lady. Bernard. You saved my life. Not at all. You're Bernard the Carpenter, yes? I am. I, I didn't realize my name was known so widely. I'm a friend of Martha's. She asked us to come and find you. Well, I'm very grateful for it. I just finished checking these piles when I turn around, I see a gang of slabbering <laughs> monsters looking to, to feast on my flesh. Mm -hmm. If you hadn't come when you did, I'd have been snipped into strips by now. Snipped into strips. Uh, I best go and give my regards to the landlady then, eh? Mm -hmm. Actually, she asked that if we found you, we should beg you make haste to repair the bridge to Eastpool. Of course. I said I'd take a look at it, but it clean slipped my mind. Oh, what? I'll head up there straight away. Do I get to explore this area? Down here? Maybe later. Is this a fetch quest? I need more materials. Uh, the trusses are still sturdy. It's just a matter of replacing the stringers and relining the deck. I'll have it done in no time. Yeah. Thank you, Bernard. We were hoping to take the road to Eastpool ourselves. We're very grateful for your help. And sorry for asking this of you after what we've been through. I owe you my life. Fixing a bridge is the least I can do. Thank you, my lady. And you too, son. <laughs> You're with Sid, and yeah. Me and him go way back. Not as far as Martha mine, but far enough. I see. Well, I best get cracking then. Yeah, it's really sad that a lot of the bears right. get, you she know, second-rate citizen status. Well. Even though they're like the backbone <laughs> of society, pretty much. Yeah, so it is though. Go back to Martha. The bridge will be fixed when it's fixed. It's fixed. I hear the levees are due to go up. Not the levees. A what? It was good. Ah, you're back. What happened? Did you find Bernard? We did. He's fine. And he'll have the bridge to Eastpool repaired soon. <sighs> well, thank the founder for that. It was lucky we found him when we did. The creatures out there are not to be trifled with. It's the Blight's fault. They'd nothing to eat in the north, so they come down here hunting for food. <sighs> he can't keep going out alone. I'd have to arrange a guard for him. But anyway, thank you. I don't have a lot to offer in return, but you're welcome to rest here until the repairs are finished. We'd be delighted. Yay. All right. Level up. Mm-hmm. Nice. So we're leveling up nicely. Can I get you a drink or anything while you wait? Flag of Imperial Gold, perhaps? Tastes like swill, but it'll slake a thirst. No, Snake. thank you. I prefer the truth. About why there are so few bears around here. Yes, there were more of them when we were young. Far more. Is this the Empire's doing? Have they been sent away? They have, I. Either to the Legions or Auriflam. Seems the miners at Drake's Head are having a hard time keeping up with demand of late. So the bearers make up the shortfall. 
Time was, they used to dole out crystals like sugar plums, even down in the plums. provinces, but not anymore. Crystal shortages. Nowadays, they'll jump at any excuse to confiscate our bearers so they can be put to work elsewhere. I always knew the Empire treated their branded like ship after seeing it with my own eyes. Well. Congratulations on your arrival. And you got the little laddie with you? It was a bearer. The boy I carried for nine long moons. A bloody bearer. Oh, you poor what? thing. You gave it to the constables then. Just left it at the garrison high. Damn. Let them deal with it. What? Couldn't wait to be rid of the blasted thing. Been wanting it gone since the moment I found out. Well, it's all dealt with now. Yeah. So no harm done, eh? Mum, you weren't my brother, was he? No. Uh. But you'll have one soon enough. You just have to be patient. So All right? Good. All right. Yeah. Teach some kids to be, like, top down there. Unbelievable. Uh, on the sand, on the bearers. Bearers may have uh. been looked down on back in Archduke Elwyn's day, but they were still human beings. Now, they've fallen so far. Beggar wouldn't spit on him. That's messed up too, because again, they are the ones that are like doing everything for society. Since <sighs> you're not drinking, do me a favor and take that to the Abbey. There's a darkness at the heart of this world, and I'd have you see it. And we'll see it at an Abbey. Glademond Abbey, on the shore of Sorrowise Bay. The abbot there is a friend. Tell him Martha sent you, and he'll show you what I mean. Understood. Hey, no one knows that. Jill here is also a bear such dominant. Let's see. How far away is that? A little far away. Uh, we'll go down the ladder again and kind of run around. Is there any? Do I want to? I don't. I think I'll go there... Normally. Can I technically come from there? I'm so confused. I'm assuming this will be the way. Uh, let's just follow the main story. Quest. Make sure you're aiming at the fish there, son. Come now, Luke. Don't be fresh shy. Cuts. Fresh cuts. Get your fresh cuts. Get your fresh cuts. <sighs> I knew that children were tested. That a bearer's fate was decided at birth. And assumed it was best for all concerned. I know, but for a child to be blamed, to be hated by its parents through no fault of its own. We knew nothing of what it meant to be born that way, did we? No. There, boy! Get him! Stay down! Get him, boy! Get him! Get him! Get him, boy! Go this way already. Or is that item uh, we stopped? Sick of toggle. Yeah, stay down. Sick of toggle. Sick of Toggle! It's over! There, boy! 
I find it funny that he's sitting here shit talking. <laughs> These like hornets and stuff. It's random. Random wildlife. We don't have to There's fight. The this, let's just. What darkness awaits us within? I wonder. Sick of Togo. You know what to do, boy. There, boy. Stay down. Good day to you. Hello? I'm afraid the Abbey is not open for public prayer. May Gregor go with you? We came to offer a donation. From Martha. <laughs> I see. Then please follow me. Mm, are there bearers inside? I wonder. I. Yep. I don't want to die. Oof. Please, Father. Come in for the pain. Thank you. The light. If it. I don't want to die alone. It's all right. I'm here. Who are these people? Martha's bearers. She entrusted them to my care, that I might ease their suffering. To the extent that I can for the time they have left. The curse has taken them. All of them. As it does every bearer forced to use their gift. With each draw on the ether, their bodies petrify, till all that remains is stone and pain, and so they are cast aside. There is nothing either Martha or I can do to change that, but we can at least strive to make their final hours a little more bearable. <laughs> Have faith, my son, for you shall rise again and find the happiness denied you in this life. Thank you, Father. I must offer you my own thanks for the medicine you so kindly brought. Ah, their final moments may be moments of peace. We 
woman next you see, Martha, pray tell her that two more have succumbed. We should get back to Martha's rest. Yes, we should. Uh, let's tell them. Well, there's also a shop. Let me check the shop out. See if there's anything better than what we got. How do? How do? Oh, we already have it. Uh, this is technically better once I forge it, probably. There you go. Hopefully. <laughs> uh, why is the music so much more expensive than everything else? Uh, let's go ahead and buy these, I guess. Thanks very much. Martha. Ah, you're back. Thanks for taking care of that. The abbot had a message for you. Two more have succumbed. I see. Come upstairs. So, now you know, eh? I've seen plenty of bearers die on the battlefield. But never like that. And all because they were born different. The powers that be can't take away their gift, so they strip them of their humanity instead. Oh, there's plenty who pity a bearer's plight. But so long as we're content to sit around, weeping for those on whose broken backs we're carried, we ain't gonna change nothing. And so you lend Sid your strength? What little of it I have. Use profits from this place to buy the poor buggers. Mm -hmm. So when the abbot told us the bearers were yours? Aye, they're my property, at least by law. Any still fit to work fetch a price beyond my means. All I can do is care for those who are past mending. It's very noble. But it's not all doom and gloom. Bernard's finished fixing that bridge for you. Yay. You can carry on to Eastpool now. You got questions that need answering, ain't you? Well, I wish you luck. Thank you, Martha. Oh, I almost forgot. Sid and I have other friends in Rosaria. Wear this, and they'll know you for one of us. Seal obtained. We accept the slumbering chocobo and from know Martha. That you will always be welcome here. Sweet. I just realized that bridge goes north from here. You were right, Sid. It really is them. Lord Rosfield and Lady Warwick have come back to us. And long may they stay. Mm. The money. Oh yeah, a lot of guild bugs, well, just two, but... Oh. Hey, Sid, what? What are you doing here? Sid? Ah, oh, Clive. You're not where I left you. <laughs> you hand. Oh. Did, I? With a thousand little lightning bolts. Oh, he has the, around the, way I used to. the thing, too, that everybody else is suffering from. Think of it as my decoration for long service and exemplary misconduct. <laughs> I 
Just oh, so that he can hide that he's a bear slash dominant. But you didn't come here to compare war wounds. <laughs> we didn't. Thank you, Sid. For everything. If you want to leave, that's your lookout. I'm sure you'll have a long and happy life together if you stay out of my way. <laughs> Sid! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Good. That guy's funny. Love that guy. I knew a girl, back in the day. She was a slave to her fate, just like you. Benedicta? I wanted to save her. Benedicta. For a while, I even thought I could. But just because you think something doesn't make it true. It's true. Sid. I'm now saviour. Just a conceited old fool. I talk about people forging their own futures. But instead of handing them the hammer, I beat them with my own. <laughs> yeah. And if no brother wants to listen to what you've got to say, you might as well keep your gob shut. True, Dan. But Clive, I will say this. You're not a monster. You're the same man you've always been. Accept that, and you may yet escape your fate. My fate? Look, lad, you've had a hard life. And I don't see it getting much easier. <laughs> you might not be able to save anyone else. But at the very least, you yeah. can save yourself. <laughs> I'll try. You gotta work. focus on yourself first, then... And Jill. I'm sorry we didn't get a chance to talk. But <laughs> she'll take good care of the boy. Always. I will. She's waifu. Is that the last of it? Aye. We best head back then. Want to keep now, waiter? So I then. All right, time to go north. Holding on. New quest is available nearby. Oh, there's two of them. There's three of them. We suppose men. We'll do. I have to find. Can't talk now, eh? Oh, you're Clive, aren't you? Martha told me all about you. Word is <laughs> you're a devil with that blade. You look like you're in a hurry. Where are you going? Not far, I hope. But I dare not waste a moment. It might cost a man his life. Sounds serious. What happened? It's not so much what happened as what might. They've discovered he's a bear, I see. Ooh. And now, one of his erstwhile friends and neighbors wants to see him clapped in chains. Damn. Where is this bearer? Nothing's changed. Fool enough to wait for the Imperials to arrive. Poor sod took to the road, left his whole life behind. But they'll be after him before long. I need to find him and get him to safety fast. Here. If you have the time of the inclination, I could do with a hand. Will you help me find him? Of course. Of course. We bearers have to look out for each other. Thank you, Clive. With your help, we might catch up with him yet. His name's Norris. Norris. We need to find him and get him to Martha before the Imperials sniff him out. You found him yet? You won't catch a bastard standing around clucking like old ends. <laughs> That fucking snake played me false, acted like he was one of us, and the old time he was one of them. We need Bruh. him caught and handed over to the Imperials. Hanging's too good for him. Bruh. Well, go on then. 
If he gets away, I'll see you fit for a noose. All right, Ronald. We were just leaving. Look, this one's here to help. I was just filling him in. Ha! Send a bearer to catch a bearer, is it? Not bloody likely. That's it. I'll find the bastard myself. Come on now, Ron. It's dangerous out there. We wouldn't want you to come to any harm. You want something done right? You don't send a bearer. Bitch. <laughs> Let's sit your ass down. This might take a while. You start hunting our man, and I'll be along once I put Ronald's mind at ease. Someone said they saw Norris heading for the Fallen Gate. Maybe you could ask if anyone over that way knows anything. We have to find him. Don't let him slip through our grasp. Wait, wait, are we saving him or not? Sounds <laughs> more like a headhunt. Let's find this Norris before Ronald takes matters into his own hands. There is a hardly difficult to spot. What do you mean about being played false, I wonder? Here, you're that bearer who works for Martha, are you? Can you give me a hand? Curse my luck, I dropped my crystal off a cliff into the bloody swamp like an utter fool. Now, I've not got your knack, see, and I need that shard to chill my fish if I'm to take him to market. But it's just a short climb down, I'll make it worth your while. <laughs> All right. I can't promise anything. Well, just promise you'll look. <laughs> ah, there may be one thing I failed to mention about the crystal. A creature might have already right. claimed it. Claimed it. Claimed it. Ate All it. Alright, eaten it, but, but, but only might have, you understand. There were a lot of bog crabs down there. Nasty buggers, them. <sighs> Sounds like I need to break a few shells. Oh, don't worry, there, there, there weren't too many of them. A veritable walk in the marsh, as they say, the ladders, right <laughs> there. Sounds good to me. Still in the light time. Oh, we just jump off the side. Who needs ladders? Oh, I guess I need ladder. Oh, don't need ladders. All right, let's kill us some crabbies. Some crabby patties. It's big. I mean, go everywhere either. You've been in. Maybe we have been here. Probably go across that bridge to see if there's anything over here. No chest or anything. Hmm, guess not. Across this bridge over here. Oh. 
close enough for that. As bandits. Oh, it's footpad people. Those down here? Oh yeah. Yeah. Pretty sure I missed that downward path because I went straight across the bridge. Some new enemies over here. Get him. Get him, boy. Sick Sick of the you know what to do, boy. Stay down. <laughs> Just killing all sorts of animals out here. Gray, gray claws. Over here. Yeah, there's a whole area down here. Let's make this quick. You know what to do. Looks like you can't hit two people with uh, two enemies with that uppercut. Come back for that. Adamant toys. 
Just keep going this way. Oh, what if we can fish? I really don't see why not. Since open world game. I was fishing in the last Mod Fantasy as well. Kinda sucks we can't do anything with the gear. Maybe not right now. Okay. Um gotta go up there. Let's see. Oh yeah, it's oh it's not an item toys, it's a big boy. on him when he's doing that. That's a very long cooldown oh, for the other Phoenix move. Oh, there's the Adamantos. Wait, I'm seeing things. Definitely thought I saw Adamantos. Marshes over there. Well, did I just come from there? That's one of our branded. 
We can't have gone far. I better keep my eyes peeled. Oh, it's the lantern. Oops. Wait, climb. A lantern. The one Norris was carrying, no doubt. At least I know which way he went. Oh, that was where the uh, foot soldiers were. <laughs> Whatever. Foot clan dudes. Someone made sure work of them. I wonder if that someone was Norris. Well, there he is. You alright, buddy? <laughs> Norris, I presume. Leave me be. You were never branded. So that's how you stayed hidden. Ronald sent you after me, did he? Set an imperial dog on his best friend. And when we were so close. I'll never forget the hatred in his eyes. But it doesn't matter now. I will not become a slave. As one bearer to another, please. Don't do this. You know how they treat our kind. Ronald didn't send me. One of Martha's men did. He wanted to make sure you were safe. I don't understand. Martha takes him, Harris. She's a friend. You can trust her. <laughs> Believe me. We never knew. I can't say I'm surprised, though. She has a kind heart. Kinder than most. Just wait here and stay out of sight. You'll be among friends soon enough. Thank you. There's few would have been so kind. And... Sorry. You're no Imperial dog. Far from it. I've been called worse. <laughs> oh. I found a lantern back there. I assume it's yours. Thanks. I dropped it when those creatures attacked me. But... If I'm honest, I wasn't all that sorry to be rid of it. Ron gave it to me. Alright. I'll keep hold of it. I might be able to use it to put an end to the Imperial search before it begins. A bear without a brand. To have lived free for so many years. I need to be betrayed by a friend. What a bitch. Anyways, let's teleport back. Turn in these quests. Oh, there's another quest north of here. We can do that too. Oh, we There you are, Clive. How goes the search? Well branded. Bitch. You found a bastard yet? Only what was left of him. A corpse torn apart by monsters. And this. Let me see that. No. It can't be. Shall we consider that the end of the matter then? Or do you need to see a body? No, no. I, I mean, I've no use for bearer bones. He's dead. Let that be an end to it. And he wished those whose job it was had done what they were supposed to do and spotted him sooner. Letting a bearer go about without a brand? It's not right, I tell you. Who want anything to do with me now, eh? There goes the bearer lover, they'll say. I'll be a laughing stock. Only cares about his public image. Is it true, Clive? Is Norris really. He's alive. You'll find him in a hut in the marshes. He's expecting you. Oh, you crafty. <laughs> Still, you did the right thing. Thank you. It's not much considering, but please, take this. Weighs well, like a thousand gil. Hey. False friends. Oh, not gil. Some random crafting material. Got this. Well, any luck? Yours, I presume. Let's 
It's nasty, Crystal. You found it, old man. You. Nice uh. blizzard stone. Any longer out in the sun, and my catch would have made for poor eating indeed. Be more careful next time. Oh, I will, I promise. No point casting my nets of a morning if I'm without crystal to see the catch to town. It was a time honest taxpaying folk could get new ones whenever they wanted. Can now, though, not for love nor money. Crystals are scarce, and the Empire tightens its purse strings more every day. Lose this little beauty again, and I might as well scrap my nets and take to begging. Take to begging? Nice. Oh, he's the one that gets a thousand. A thousand gila. Oh, it's saved. I haven't saved in a while. Now for the quest up north. Okay. Can delete a mark or put a mark if I wanted to. That's okay. It's already marked. Uh, is it this one? Yeah, it's not this one. Let's mm -hmm. let the ladies work. Right. Yep. Bridge is done. Don't you worry about them boards. I use good solid lumber. Space on the other side. Martha said the blight is probably even further south. Pushing yet more monsters down with it. I dare say we'll be seeing a few along the way. Then we shall have to keep our wits about us. A lot of sharp things. Hey, Vanda! Come on, Vanda! Come Appreciate the raid. How did your stream go? pretty good. We beat Benedicta. Messed her up. And yeah, we found out that Clive was, as I kind of predicted, <laughs> was a freak. Oh. Uh, but we're still looking for the other guy, which we also found out was the brother this whole time. There's so many things I kind of predicted, <laughs> but it was verified in game, so... Get a boy. 
Oh, spin it out. Okay, now we're on an adventure with our good old friend, Jill. Slowly getting better at this combat. Yeah, we're since taking the Benedictus Creator powers. It's been really interesting. I can already imagine how complex like the combo system can be. You just like keep switching between and different icon powers and just keep spamming and everything. And then he's gotta worry about your uh, cooldowns. I'm not interested in knowing how many icon like powers you can have at once. Like right now we have two, right? Wind and fire. But I wonder if there's gonna be a third one. It looks like there's gonna be a third one. So you can just kinda have on there. Um Oh we'll see. Still really. Uh, we just did a bunch of side quests in this area. I'm about to go to this other side quest. And yeah, just slowly progressing through everything. Oh, I was like, what is that? <laughs> that's that's the turtle we just killed. Hey Becca, what's up? How are you? Welcome on in. Yeah, I think I mentioned this last stream. I know it's definitely the beginning of this stream, but yeah, the fight system really reminds me of Devil May Cry. Everything kind of free flows and then like grabbing ability from the Garuda. Icon ability is pretty nice. Yeah, that's uh, a new Devil May Cry yeah, Nero Habit. Let's see, I'm almost I'm done with work. Just waiting for the director to release me. Release Becca. <laughs> Hashtag free Becca. <laughs> 2022. Oh, I just like blew up that spider from Tyler. From downtown. Did he usually uh, stay this late at work? Okay. <laughs> Bring me from the smoke. Not work. Oh, smoke. Oh yeah. I heard there was a forest fire, or something rather, in Canada. I don't know exactly from where, but I mean, which part of Canada? I'm assuming is by you, though. Alright, he's Gazelle. <laughs> Get over here! Alright, he's Antelope. <laughs> Just killing the local wildlife, you know. Protagonist things. And usually later. And usually work till late, super late. It's the holiday, or it's the holiday, it's the weekend. <laughs> it's the weekend. Oh, you also work weekends, don't you? I don't remember. Stay down. <laughs> yeah, I just love us just kicking the crap out of the local wildlife and then having meat and crabs and crawfish. Yeah, even this jumping downward strike is this the Helmbreaker from Devil May Cry. Yeah, so much... I don't know if it's like influence from them or what, but... So many moves. And even this has a stinger. Stinger! Oh, so yeah. So, kind of the transition into this fighting engine has been pretty smooth. It's just me remembering everything. It's the hard part. Hmm. 
Let's see, am I going the right way? Yeah. Yeah, I think... I'm not quite sure when I'm going to end stream, but I'm just going to keep playing. Because it's addicting. I do need to eat dinner, though. Which I'm not quite sure what I'm going to have tonight. Well, I ate very light today, so I kind of want to feast. Oh, there's dudes. Hello, friends. Oh, yeah, I unlocked this ability, too. I spent all of my... <laughs> All my ability points. I unlock that one. I'm stepping on his dick. <laughs> it's hilarious that they called the foot pad. <laughs> it's like what? What kind of name is this? Um, the air quality is better, but still hazy. I need air purifier for your old apartment. Oh jeez. You have your mask for your way home. Oh man. So it's at like very. It's at hazy, so it's kind of like a fog. That's like. Smoke. One of our volleyball playoffs I supervised was canceled Wednesday night because of the air. Oh, wait, is it outdoors? Or is it indoors? But it's still like too hazardous to do stuff. We actually haven't played volleyball for the past two days. I played on Wednesday. I wish I didn't. <laughs> it was not enjoyable because my knee acted up again. Honestly, I think I just don't stretch enough. So. I'm just uh, tight, tight buttocks. <laughs> it's the same as the one back at the hideaway. Uh, so yeah, it kind of like affects many. Oh, there's another one of these things. Out. Yeah, it does not work. Interesting. Oh, it's a interesting wyvern. Oh, Perry, son. Get down. Oh, yeah, this move is really good at stunning. Get out of this, guys. Oh, dang it. You got me. <laughs> you got me. Oh, I totally missed that. Oh, yeah, I think I'm gonna wait till Sunday to play volleyball. Oh, perfect dodges. Oh, where'd come from? Uh, you should give yourself, what, 20 minutes? Warm up, sucks though. Been through it with your ankle too. Did you re injure your ankle at all or tweaked it? Or are you just still feeling the effects of hurting it? Um, was it last month? Or was it a month ago? Two months ago? Bloodhawk. Whoops. Bloodhawk, yes. What's this? I really don't want to have to, like, make Torgo do moves. I kind of want him to do it on his own. Uh, increases aerial combo damage by 8%. Which is too much. <laughs> or not enough, I mean. Maybe I should do that. Actually, yeah, let's add that. See, I haven't played in almost two weeks because of drama. Drama? Kind of drama. Yeah, me is just making my knee acts up. It felt pretty good on Tuesday, and then last Sunday I played, and it was pretty good. But, yeah, I don't know. I just gotta keep stretching it every day. Let's see, lucky work had good ventilation and filters. Nice, nice. Slumbering Chocobo, you wearing? Slumbering Chocobo. Yeah. Good. She won't because me and you see. Spent three days for us not seeing the sun clearly. Oh man. We tried dealing with them ourselves. 
Oh yeah, I remember seeing the Persona meme about that. <laughs> it's as if you're, the TV world's spilling out all over the place. I expect the blight drove them here. I remember getting into Arthur with somebody because I spoiled the game <laughs> using a, a gif from the game. I'm like, I actually feel like I injured my other ankle. Oh no, but they're fine. Because I start a new beach league in a week. Oof. Yeah, hopefully everything works out. We'll deal with the wolves, eh? Right. I suppose those wolves pose a threat to everyone. Yeah, I'm gonna hey, wait till Sunday to play again. Um, technically, both there's two locations that are open tomorrow to play, but I don't know. I don't really have the desire to go play at either of those you locations. One, hmm? Go and speak to my friend over the bridge. Bryce, his name is. You wanna know if he's safe to come across? But I don't know. Maybe I should. Nah, nah, I should stick with not playing. I really need to heal. I really need to do strengthening exercises. What's going on here? Up, 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 up. <laughs> Dog noises. Ow. GG's. Starving out though. Oh what? Alright. Oh. Is that guy not the actual quest giver? Let me keep running around. That's a big Minotaur. Minotaur. Get him. Sick of Damn, boys. I didn't dodge at all. Moosh. Almost didn't dodge that. Get him. Sick of toggle. Get him, boy. There, boy. Get him, boy. Get him. Oh, I dashed too early. <laughs> this time. Sick of toggle. Catch him up. You know what to do, boy. Not this time. Oh, why don't you just switch over there? Uh, so you gotta find some food, I'll tell you drama later, but it's about me getting kicked out of my area intermediate Mondays into a drop-in for getting into it with the captain. The heck? And their drop in owner. Huh. Strange. I mean, I get that food. I don't know how long I'll be streaming, but if you're, if you're back, then I will hear it. Maybe we can share the story tomorrow. So I plan on streaming this some more. Oh, another Minotaur.
kind of want to get pizza, but at the same time, I'm lazy to order it. I didn't press the dodge button. I did that too early. Gosh, way too early. Thank you, Jill. Eat this. Oh, that's a lot of damage. I pressed it early again. I pressed it early again. <laughs> Jesus. So bad at dodging. Stream in a long time, maybe Discord. You don't fall asleep. <laughs> Alright, take care, Becca. Have a safe trip home through the fog. <laughs> oh, church chest. I appreciate both of you stopping in. If I don't catch you later, then I'll see you next time. Uh, let's make sure I got everything. I find it kind of interesting how some of these monsters are definitely a lot harder to fight, but... Uh... Get back over here. They don't give you that much experience. But then you fight like, you know, four of these wasps which are really easy to kill and you get like the same amount of experience. You think these... Wait, you think I'm giving bad sets when I set to his wreckly girlfriend? <laughs> Poor. Uh, and he's just being a dominating presence on the board. I'm definitely the best server on this team. Oof. Yeah, it sucks when people don't have the same, like... I don't know, mentality. Or something something, I don't know. That sucks, though. That's... <laughs> So you really just didn't play with them for like three weeks? Or two weeks? Uh, but yeah, if it's like low level... Yeah, rec level, right? So that's like very... Beginner. <laughs> or like, whatever. But... I don't know, is his... Girl that good? <laughs> I guess? I don't know. I try to avoid that. What's her skill level? Sometimes you can give like, the best sets ever, but if the player isn't all that good, they can't really do anything with it. Um, but I do have this one couple that comes on Wednesdays that I played with a couple times, and they're both pretty bad, <laughs> to be honest. The one guy is just tall, and so he's able to do stuff because he's tall. But he's not that great. <laughs> he's like very antsy, his footwork's very like jittery, I feel. Um, and then his girl is yeah, very beginner. And yeah, she has, I always like cringe to wait and see what she does. <laughs> but I could set her pretty well. Like I set her pretty low still, but it's easier to adjust when it's lower and you know, low and off and like pretty much in front of her face. So I just like wince every time she has to do something with it. I'm like, <laughs> hold my breath a little bit. But this is what it is. Can't really make people evolve on on the spot. They're not ready. Um, they play for five weeks. This guy thinks he's competitive and she's average, decent hitter, but does it move? That's the worst. Oh, what if they're going to fix this and we get to use this boat? That'd be great. 
That means we can only park at docks. There's a couple docks in various places, I think. There's a pier. Well, maybe not. Maybe it's wishful thinking. But yeah, I just laugh. <laughs> you know, just say it's okay. Etc, etc. And then, you know, if she makes a mistake, I try to cover as best I can. As long as the ball's up, I can try to get to it, but sometimes I don't try because it's too much effort. <laughs> but if it's, like, in my vicinity, I will try to help, but I'm not going to kill myself <laughs> and try to fix an error. Let's wait for the next ball. You, Bryce. You, Bryce. What's it to you, Bearer? Your friend asked me to get rid of the wolves. So I got, so rid, I got of the rid of the wolves. <laughs> You'd have me believe a single bearer slew the entire pack. Surprise. And again, if you didn't, you wouldn't be on this side of the bridge. Bugger me. Bugger me, you're a tough one, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Frederick. You wily bastard. I never thought to pit beast against beast like that. Yeah. You served us well, bearer. Be sure to pass our thanks to your master. Yeah, I, again, we're just, I'm pretty sure it's just for social commentary purposes, but I really hate that they look down on bearers slash people who have the ability to cast magic without crystals. Like, <laughs> they're better than you. <laughs> but for some reason, these regular people are uh, putting them down. I don't know. It's like X-Men all over again. Look, the windmills. That must be Eastpool. Excellent. Yeah. Yeah. You know it's I like how that Hellbreaker hits multiple times as long as it's keeps hitting them on the way down. Oops. Oh, there's antelope everywhere. Oh, I love how you touch it and that's when they go wild on you. So you didn't have to come to this. Six bloody hides. I remember coming here with Lord Murdoch when I was young. Murdoch. Was oh yeah. A very different place back then. That guy. This trainer. I forgot what happened to Murdoch. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he got killed. Because yeah, he was defending his dad, and yeah, they got betrayed, so everybody died. Except with mom, which I'm pretty sure we'll deal with her at some point. She's the one that did all this. Uh, oh, there's something back here. Let's see what's back here first, and then we'll go to the main mission area. <laughs> that spider out of here. Let's boot it out of here. Thousand mobility points. Let's see if I can upgrade. Which one is this one? Yeah, this. I wonder if this makes it. I'm pretty sure this makes it charge faster. I should also upgrade this since I use it a lot. I should use this one too. Let's upgrade all the. Abilities. Uh, I don't really need. Well, what if this opens the precise dodge window by a little bit? Do I want this? Maybe I want the perfect dodge thing first. 
the upgrade. What's over here? It's like some big boss fight. It's not quite a boss, but... Really fast. That's a lot of damage. Not this time. Not this time. It's over. I do like that charge so fast now. Oh, I wonder if it charges... So right now it's at fire, right? Uh, my spell. And then I can charge it, it turns into fear. I wonder if we can charge even further. We get Faraga. I'm pretty sure it's going to let us do that. It has to. Just got to wait till we uh, get further into the main story, probably. Yeah, maybe it's a good time to get a Euro tonight. Last day of the month. Go ahead and go to this main quest. That was a real janky jump over that <laughs> fence. Alright. East Pool, the pro Imperial Province of Rosario. Quiet, isn't it? Yes. Clyde Frostfield. Oh, what? <laughs> it's, it's... it's me, Hannah. Rodney Murdoch's oh, wife. It's his trainer's <laughs> wife. It's so sad. Oh, I knew it was you. You haven't changed at all. What? <laughs> We're 13 years older. What are you talking about? <laughs> it's so good to see you both again. <gasps> oh. So sad. It's good to see you too, Lady Hannah. <gasps> yeah, so sweet, yeah. So sad. If you have time, you simply must come back to the house. I haven't much to offer, but what is mine is yours. Oh yeah, I wanted to mention that Jill's hair kind of looks like uh, Tifa's hair. We should be delighted. Her style. It's that long ponytail. But I think uh, Tifa's is longer. If I'm not mistaken. Yes! <laughs> yeah. You thought the same thing? Yep. And you have been wandering the world ever since. I noticed almost immediately. I can well understand fleeing from those iron blood brutes. Like both Tifa and Mixo, the main. To take to the road at such a nine. Oh, uh. Dagger? <laughs> no, Garnet. I actually don't remember her actual name. We just call her Garnet. Or Princess Garnet. Where there was Wasn't Princess easy, Garnet, surname. But we survived. And... But yeah, I can see that. And now we're back. Now we're back. It's wonderful to see you safe and well, Lady. Her long hair was like Jill's, yeah, until she cut it for character growth purposes. <laughs> It's kind of funny, that's always the iconic thing to do, I guess. Just cut your hair, change your hairstyle. New hair, new you. 
I actually never got to that phase where I just like shave all my head or hair off. Like buzz cut everything. And I've done the opposite where I grew my hair out. That happened in college, early college. This house holds a lot of I don't think you ever seen me in my longer hair. So long as I can live here in peace, here I shall stay. Hmm. I agree with the last Not thing I heard. Matter. I'm super positive on court. So, I guess civilians. that pissed By that guy religious. off. <laughs> People don't like you being happy. Happy go lucky. Should I say, Did not see me long here. I can show you my license. Annabella's marriage to the Emperor of <laughs> Without giving me my. Many changes here. <laughs> see my. Yes. Everything else. But yeah. Of course. I had long hair. Oh, forgive me. <laughs> I, I didn't and mean to. Uh, even this uh, please, license, I didn't take a new picture. Nothing to forgive. I was too lazy, so I just renewed it online. <laughs> That's back in my uh, anime slash J Rocker days. <laughs> I wasn't actually a J Rocker, but. I kind of like the anime hairstyle, Asian hairstyle. You haven't heard then. Yeah, <laughs> like anime character. Robin it's funny because I actually used to flare my hair as well. Like it was long, but I also like gave it the uh, kind of like I don't know how to explain it. Well, he got burned because of Clive. Dang it! I can't remember now. Clive, my poor child. My poor child. Okay. All this traveling must have taken yeah. toll. It's kind of interesting. Talk about my long hair. Uh, I used to work at Chick Fil A, and as we know, hmm. it's very oily back there because you know, it evaporates, <laughs> and so the air is like oily. I won't say it like that. <laughs> and so when I would go to the salon, uh, or one time, uh, the ladies like. Are you sure I forget exactly what they said because it, it, it was in Vietnamese, but they're pretty much just uh, admiring how nice my hair was. <laughs> I was like, thank you. Lady and they're like, you understand? It's like, yes. <laughs> so I never spoke to them in Vietnamese, but she really has been very kind. That's pretty funny. I saw a man with a mission and survived, said the prophet. I picked Jay Rockers in concert in the last two months. Oh, nice. Oh, this is the first time Clive's not wearing his gear. Years, Aside from being naked <laughs> earlier. Pretty sure Amanda remembers that part. Oh. <laughs> Five crying. It was only Joshua that kept me going. I swore that I would avenge his death. That I would kill. His <laughs> oh, you remember. Killer. Oh, yeah. <laughs> It's all cheeks. It's all cheeks. <clears throat> but if it was me who killed Joshua and Murdoch and all the others, just kill me now. Then why the hell am I still breathing? I ask myself the same. Oh, yeah, she's killed hundreds. Yep. Hundreds died. There were so many oh yeah, bodies. Jill's story was pretty so sad too. Cut short in their she got captured and almost uh, raped and pillaged, but day, she awoken as a Shiva dominant. I wanted to now she's a weapon. I wanted it all to end. Yeah, now she's killing everybody. I couldn't bear it anymore. If living meant being that, better to be just another body. I'm sorry. Oh. What's that look, Jill? Do you remember <laughs> that night on the balcony? When we looked up at the moon? I said a prayer to make Oh, it's that same that red dot in the sky. Oh. It's her kid self. So. Oh. You came back to me. The heavens must have a plan for us. <laughs> I 
<laughs> She's like, damn it. <laughs> Come on, Clive. We should get some rest. Ah. <laughs> it's that meme <laughs> when Good was night. it the uh, guy so oblivious while the girl's giving like super obvious signs? <laughs> that was that was that moment right there. But yeah, they're definitely gonna be a thing later on. Hopefully, probably. It better be. Thank you, Ariana. Perhaps now people will not flee at the sight of me. You look just like Elwyn did when he was your age. Oh, we got new, new threads. How did you come to have some of my? Oh yeah. Oh, well, before Elwyn became Archduke, our families would often summer together. He and Rodney were like brothers. These clothes have been in a wardrobe for years, collecting cobwebs along with everything else. He kind of looks like an assassin now. Well, I'm very assassin. For them. And sorry for like from Assassin's Creed. Not at all. Looks like Ezio. It's what your father would have wanted. The drip. Hey, oh yeah. They suit you well. <laughs> There's so much tension Thank between you. them. <laughs> or at least, you know, for, from her perspective. Yes. Clive is kind of just Thank like... You. You've been I don't know. Kind. I guess he sees her as that no, childhood friend should that he you. shouldn't go for. It may only have been for a short while. I don't know. But seeing you again took me back to happier times. <laughs> Fare you well. My lord and lady. And you, Lady Hannah. You're over it. They need to make sweet love, sweet babies. Mm, fire and ice. Ooh. If we follow the road to the north. So I mean this whole time I wasted money on all these gear pieces. <laughs> Dang it. Of course we didn't know. They're just gonna give us some sweet threads. Uh, but yeah, they're definitely hitting hinting towards it. It's gonna happen. It's gotta wait. Wait for the opportune moment. You should take us all the way to Phoenix Gate. Phoenix Let's Gate. Go. Is there any side quest nearby? Nope. I think we're good. Let's see what you're selling. Anything take your fancy? Gaia Blade, I got one. Or something better than actually. Maybe we got good gear now. At least for now. I don't really need those. 40,000 for a song. Jesus. Uh, let's sell those gill bugs. There it is. I have four of them. Oh, damn. This should make me a few gill. Oh, can I sell this? Yeah. It's black blood. Got anything else for me? I'm rich. Goblin coin. Oh, it's three of them. This should make me a few gill. Anything else that's just for selling? I wish there was a way to just sell it. Like, all the soon, junk. Though. Instead of having to choose it. Get out of here. I guess I'm contextual button pressing. You! You! Those are Elwins! By the flames. You're his firstborn. Clive Ross. I'm Dragonborn. You're mistaken. <laughs> Bruh, that's your clothes. <laughs> I don't think I'd mistake anything. Fool me, my lord. You're the very image of your father. Oh, that's true. Now, that would be he does true look like daddy now. He, he is clothes. daddy. The self-same garments Hannah was keeping for you, if I'm not mistaken. She always swore that she would never part with them until the day Elwyn's sons returned. And now that day has come. <laughs> Why, you'll be able to take your bearers back as well. Mm, but I am a bearer. My bearers. Or, 
Brandon, I should say. Not bad. Do we get to have a base? Is this what they're saying? Forgive me, Master Mayor. I was a child when last I came to East Poland. I didn't recognize oh. you. Oh, I'd be surprised if you recognized anything at all. Much has changed since Rosaria fell to the Empire. Not least for the bearers who once served her noble families. When the Iron Blood sacked Rosalina thirteen years back, many who lost their masters fled here in search of sanctuary. And never returned. Aye. The plan was to send them home once we won back the capital. But then the Imperials arrived. And then we're fucked. This area became a province of San Breck. The duchy was dissolved and they no longer had any home to return to. Back in your father's day, any bearer who lost their master became a ward of the duchy. We mm. hand them over to the sheriffs and they'd be assigned a new position. Times changed. But when we saw how the Empire treated their Shit. branded. We knew that wasn't an option. I hope we topple so this they empire. It's their bitches. <laughs> and now you want to give them to me. They're yours by right, Lord Rosfield. Bequeathed you by your late father. And they'd be better off serving you than hiding here. Indeed, many of them used to serve your house. And still consider the Rosfields their masters. I'm no one's master. Not anymore. Mm -hmm. They wouldn't be safe with me. It's like a Joko that looks at you. I that understand. Jill, like how Jill looks at Why? You forgive an old man his fanciful notions. Are you gonna he head off to bed? Sounds good. Too long, but yes, still, thanks for the raid. I Hope you have a good night. A favor of you. A small mercy. So I do want to try to get to the end of this area. I guess I'll end my stream there. I still need to eat. Swears absolute loyalty to Archduke Elwin. I don't ask that you <laughs> take him into your service. Only that you meet with him. Let him see that Elwin's son still lives. And that he's as fine a man as his father ever was. So far. It would be my honor. Thank you, my lord. He sits by the well most days, watching the people go about their business. If you could show him your face, I would be most grateful. <laughs> Back in the day. <laughs> as fine a man as my father. You're not so very different, you know. Especially dressed like that. <laughs> Come on, let's go and meet that bearer. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> He's not here. Well, I can't leave without meeting him. I've let the mayor down once already. Oh. You will be cruel to disappoint him again. Right, let's ask around. Someone must have seen him. Hey. Well now, unfamiliar faces. What brings you to East Paul, travelers? We're looking for an elderly bearer. You wouldn't happen to have seen him, would you? Ah, you mean the old boy who always waits by the well? Yes, that's him. What, uh, what business do you have with him, if you don't mind me asking? You're not from the capital too, are you? We are, in a way. Well then, it's a pleasure to meet a fellow Rosalithian. I was Rosa born and down Market Street. I never would have left if Archduke Elwyn had survived the fire. Oh, what? It wasn't the same when the Duchess took over, though. All the beatings, the evictions, the levies going up and up and up, even as the blight took half the harvest. Oh, listen to me, telling you what you already know. I'm sorry. I'm afraid I can't help you with your bearer either, though I doubt you'd have gone far. He comes here every day, almost as if he's waiting for something. No. We'll keep asking around then. Thank you. I'm waiting for us to come back. 
Hello. Good day, milady. What can I do for you? I'm looking for a bearer. What can I do for you? An elderly fellow who used to serve the Rosfields. Have you seen him? Ah, that old loon. No, no sign of him today. Funny, he's usually down by the well at this hour, cooking up his fantasy feasts. I'm sorry? Oh, he worked in the kitchens at Rosaleth Castle back in the day. Still thinks he's there now. <laughs> You'll often hear the poor fool chatting away to the Archduke. Living in a dream he is. But better there than here, I suppose. Can't imagine the Viceroy stopping to trade tales with a bearer. Can you? No. Anyway, you'll be round here somewhere. Doubt he has the path to stray too far. Thank you. We'll keep looking. Hey, hold on a mo. Young Patrick, the chocobo keeper, might know where he is. He's taken the old bird under his wing, so to speak. He'll be in the stables. You should go and have a word with him. Patrick the chocobo keeper. Thank you. We will. I'm sorry, Jill. For making you do all this in my stead. It can't be helped if we're to keep up pretense. Come on, let's head for the stables. Hmm, where the bloody hell's he got to? Excuse me, but is something the matter? What did the He's matter? This bearer I've been minding. I take my eyes off him for one minute and he disappears. He's not in his usual spot by the well nor anywhere else in the village. You must be Patrick. Patrick. I am, but... And this bearer you're looking for, he's an elderly man who used to work in the Rosalith Castle kitchens, yes? That's the fella. And you know all this. I've never seen you in his <laughs> before. But you seem to know the place better than I do myself. Well... Ah, so that's how it is. Well then, if you're acting under orders of the mayor, you're on about to help me find him. He's been losing what little sense he had left of late, saying the sheriffs are coming to collect him, and that he needs to go back to the castle. I was supposed to watch over him, keep him out of trouble. But if he's walked out on us, there's not a lot I can do. Understood. You keep searching here, we'll look for him outside. Thank you. I'm in your debt. I hope he hasn't wandered into trouble. Let's just concentrate on finding him. So you definitely know he did. Still no sign. Oh. Could he have strayed even further? Oh, it's down that path I went to already. Oh, this item restum uh, spawned. Do I have to find another dragon? Look, there's someone over there. It might be him. We should hurry. Wasps. Company. <laughs> Killer bees. They need to die. They need to okay. die. Oh, get over here. More enemies. 
Oh, doggos. I totally with that. The more doggos. Let's hit all of them. Sound like it. Oh yeah, it did. Hell, it did. Nice. <laughs> it gives like no experience. Are you all right, my friend? Come on. Let's go home. Your grace. You came for me. I waited for you so long, but you finally came. I'm not who you think. Clive. <sighs> Better bake it for this old man's sake. Yes. Pray forgive my long delay. It's nothing, Your Grace. I prayed to the founder that you would come, and at long last, he answered. Will we be returning to the castle then? There is still a place for me in the kitchens? No, my friend. We will not be returning to the castle, not yet. I am on a very important expedition. One which may take some time. You... Wait for me in Eastpool. Until my journey is complete. I will come back for you then. I promise. Of course, Your Grace. For of course. You, I would gladly wait until my dying day. Yes. Nice. Thank you, both of you. You've been most kind. The memory of serving the late Archduke was as one light in the darkness. And now that light burns a little more brightly. It's nothing but a fantasy, of course. But it's better than the truth of the matter. A damn sight better. The blight is on our doorstep. Our harvests are failing. The people are leaving in droves. If it weren't for Lady Hannah selling half our worldly goods to provide for the few of us who stay behind, we would long since have starved. We want to keep the bearers safe here, we really do. But unless a miracle happens, we won't be able to spare a crust of bread to share between them soon enough. Is it really that bad? So bad. I even petitioned the Imperial Garrison to take them. But when they found out where they'd come from, they damn near spat in our faces. Ducal dogs, they called them. Enemies of the Empire. I know a man named Sid, who would gladly give a home to any bearer in need of one. Leave this with me. As soon as I return from Phoenix Gate, I'll speak with him. Thank you, my lord. Will you be passing through Eastpool on your way back? I should very much like to speak with you again, if you have the time, regarding the future of the village, and what might be done for Lady Hannah. After all, she's done for us. Yes, of course. I'll be back alone. Fare you well, my lord, my lady. I wish you a safe journey. Quest to complete. I can do it. Nice. Alright, let's go off to the Phoenix Gate. Though I think it's might be over. At least this like segment. It's gonna be its own like like arena type thing. Or map. Oh the blight, it's here. The Deadlands are aptly named. I didn't realize they were this close. No wonder their crops are failing. The blight is leaching the ether from the soil. Or oh. when the last drop is drained, their fields will turn to this. No plants. 
No animals. No life. And no monsters. I suppose that's one small mercy. Is that back here? There should be. It's a door. Is it a fake door? What's this? Another relic of the fallen. Can't go that way. Ooh, looks like it's gonna be a dungeon for later. We won't be able to use any magic here. Another thing to worry about. As if the absence of ether didn't cause enough problems. Hey, Take Phoenix away that life force, and problems are on us left. All right, make sure I don't miss any thing. I can hardly imagine what this place used to look like before the blight took it. I remember. It was beautiful. Dim obelisk activated. Are we at Phoenix Gate? There it is. Yep. Phoenix Gate. Where it all went wrong. Come on, Clive. Gotta do it. It's time to discover the truth. All right. Well, that's probably going to do it for me today. When we come back, we will see what the truth is. Can't save from here. It's gonna make me go in real quick. And I'll save after. <sighs> yeah, let me just watch this cutscene, then we can get out of here. It's food. Some sleep. It's almost as if time had stood still. I'm sorry. I suppose no one had any cause to return here. No. It's just as I left it. Phoenix Ash. Let's have a look around. Right. Well, guys, I'm gonna tackle this next time. But for now, hope everyone has a good night. And until next time.